plasma bit drilling, unlocking the potential geothermal energy future of clean energy. Today, the inefficient coal production in open pit lignite mines needs to be heavily subsidized with taxpayer money. At the same time, it still has a negative impact on the quality of life in neighboring communities. And while the burning of coal in power plants generates baseload electricity, it also stands in the way of the efforts to cut greenhouse gas emissions and achieve ambitious climate targets that have been agreed at at the EU level. Geothermal Energy The first industrial geothermal electricity plant opened in Lardarello, Italy in 1904. In 1913, it was producing 250 kilowatts of electricity. Over a hundred years later, in 2016, geothermal energy worldwide produced 750,000 gigawatt hours per year. Geothermal is cheap, reliable, and renewable, providing heating, electricity production, and cooling. In Europe, Italy and Turkey are the largest users of geothermal, alongside France and Germany, and more recently, Eastern European countries like Poland and the Czech Republic, which sit above the Podhale Basin. Cities across the world use geothermal to heat entire communities, like Reykjavik in Iceland, where 99% of its space heating has been provided by geothermal since the 1930s. However, the United States, Indonesia, and the Philippines have overtaken Italy as geothermal world leaders. Is it possible to use geothermal energy everywhere? Large-scale geothermal energy has long been constrained to volcanic areas where heat can easily be captured and turned into electricity. According to industry estimates, 70% of the Earth's surface could provide geothermal power using modern drilling techniques. As the temperature of the Earth's crust increases with depth by around 30 centigrade per kilometer, deep drilling increases the availability of geothermal energy. However, the cost of big geothermal projects can be prohibitive. Conventional geothermal drilling is only cost efficient up to the depth of 5 kilometers in soft rock. With each additional kilometer, and especially in harder rocks, costs increase exponentially and beyond a sustainable return on investment. The reason is that between 40 and 70 percent of the overall project budget is spent on hiring, shipping, and using the drill. This is why, until now, geothermal power plants with more substantial energy output have only been built where the Earth's heat is accessible at shallower depths, such as in Iceland, parts of the USA, New Zealand, the Philippines, small parts of Italy, Azor Islands in Portugal, or Turkey. Plasma bit drilling techniques can end dependence on fossil fuels. Enter Plasma bit, a drilling platform developed by Slovak technology startup GA Drilling. It has clear step change cost, performance, working life, and environmental impact advantages compared to a conventional mechanical bit in deeper depths. The rapid rate of penetration in hard rock environment ensures linear drilling costs instead of exponential. As a result, costs of drilling per meter are lower by an order of magnitude when compared with conventional drilling techniques. The plasma arc disrupts the rock at a very high temperature of 6,000 degrees centigrade that is comparable to the surface of the sun. Plasma bit drilling technology enables cost-efficient access to baseload high temperature heat sources, about three to 400 degrees centigrade, up to 10 kilometers below the Earth's surface. We are unlocking the vast potential of deep geothermal for all who need access to low-cost, 24-7 renewable energy, explains Igor Kosis, CEO of GA Drilling. Since the revolutionary platform doesn't require contact with the rock formation, it is inherently less prone to any mechanical wear. This reduces the need for regular replacement of the tool as well as the costly downtime. By combining plasma bit solution with a conventional off-the-shelf modular system in conjunction with engineering, procurement, and construction partners, plasma bit will deliver the ultra-deep geothermal energy at low cost anywhere. The lower noise generation and resonance below 40 decibels beyond a 300 meter depth also makes the technology viable in populated areas. Geothermal energy is the only true 24-7 baseload renewable energy source, an essential answer to the current global decarbonization challenge. The exploitation of ultra-deep geothermal energy can unlock not only unlimited power, but also be very financially attractive. 
The reason is that water of 300 degrees centigrade in depths contains five times as much energy as water at 200 degrees centigrade in a shallower geothermal well. While still in the middle of an extensive technology testing in real-world conditions, the company has already started to plan its first major pilot project. We have identified several locations in Europe with most favorable combinations of geological profile and energy market conditions and launched the first round of talks with the potential partners. Our aim is to form a consortium and build a power plant with installed capacity of MIN 20 MW, said Mr. Kosis. So that was it for today's video and if you find it useful, hit the like button. For more videos, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get any updates from our channel.